OpenID Connect based single sign-on will allow WPO365 to request an ID token for a user that successfully authenticated with Microsoft. We need to perform a couple of steps to configure this ID token and to configure the claims, basically the fields, the user attributes that uh, this ID token will contain. To do so, we need to go to the token configuration of our registered application. We click optional claims and we select the ID token as the token type where we want to add our claims to. And here we will check the options for email, for family name, for given name and for UPN. UPN is the user principal name, the basically the uh, Microsoft login name. Um, to finish this off, we will click add and we are asked whether we also want to turn on the Microsoft Graph permissions for email and profile. We check the box to add those uh, so we don't have to add those anymore later when we configure the API permissions for this registered application. So we click add as well. Our app registration is updated and we have added optional claims for email, family name, given name and UPN.